Hey you guys, it's me, Mrs. Wacky Jackie, and I just wanted to show you what I got um, last week. It is, <laughs> let me step into frame. I am still trying to get used to this. Um, it is the Shorts, <laughs> Shorts Cop Got To Be Rocking It um, Forever, Sto Forever Style Stay Encore Fresh Dry Shampoo. Um, I just decided to go ahead and let's do a demo. I've never used this before. I got this, uh, but I will get one free at Walgreens. Walgreens, every once in a while, if you check out online at walgreens.com or um, your local Sunday ad, or if you just so happen to get the ad in your mail, um, they always have like buy one, get one free. And so this was like $6, but I got two cans for $6. I usually buy the Tresemme, um, dry shampoo, these, the also aerosol can for oily hair. So yeah, it's new dry shampoo. And so yeah, this is the first time I'm using it. And so we're just gonna figure this out um, together, okay? So it says shake can very well before usage. Hold can eight inches above your head. Spray in short bursts into sections of your hair using your fingertips. Work it into your roots, then evenly brush out. Now you're ready to rock another day. So, um, I've never used this before. So, what I usually like to do is I like to use these kind of combs right here. Um, like a rat tail comb and this. Just something like fine tooth because using a brush, it, it does work, but... Um, yeah, so first I like to, my, where I usually get oily is obviously my crown, but like my bangs area, I don't really have real bangs, but what's considered like my bangs, it's really oily. I think it's not only because of my head, but it's probably also because they lay on top of my forehead, which is really oily as well. So I'm going to actually... I usually don't section off, but we're going to actually kind of follow directions today. And so I'm going to section, I'm just going to do it in two sections. So we're going to, you know, do this right here. And I got a, a tie. I always wear hair ties on my, on my wrist. And I'm about ready to go out to do some Lunar New Year stuff. So, um, we're going to. I don't like to wash my hair every day, all the time, just because I feel like it strips the hair and everything. So, shake it, like it said. It's aerosol can and eight inches. So I'm gonna guess eight inches is like this far. And we're gonna do, I'm gonna do from the back part. So I don't know how well we're gonna be able to see this. So. short burst right here. That's a pleasant smell. And then ooh. and I'm gonna take this out and I'm gonna do like my mid part right here and my base which are predominantly the ones that are All right, and then it says, what is it? Use your fingertips and work it into your roots. So, man, what I do for you guys. So I'm gonna work it, 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 work it really good. I'm almost like, I'm almost like basically like shampooing my hair again. It's just, you know, whatever. So yeah, do your little dance, work your hair. <laughs> um, okay, and then brush it out, which I'm gonna use this, my rat tail comb, and I'm gonna brush it. Really, I'm just gonna brush it first, uh, comb it first, and then uh, go ahead and comb it the way that I usually have my hair. So it's a brush and then excuse me I'm gonna get my regular brush and kind of go like that 
and part my hair and wow wow I really like this I don't know if there's a white cast though so I don't know do you do you guys see a white cast or maybe like it's too sunny out there for you guys to see what's going on but yeah I mean first impression I'm really digging it it's not, um, it does leave like this residue, but I gotta tell you the Tresa May one, which I don't have anymore because I used it all, it totally, it's totally like, it. I guess it uses clay and as you keep on using like a fine tooth comb, it's just gonna accumulate and accumulate and accumulate. And it gets nasty on the comb, and you have to run hot water. <laughs> My husband ran hot water through the comb to get all the clay out because he was like, that's getting nasty. Um, but yeah, the smell, I gotta say, I think I like the Tresemme smell a little bit better. But I feel like this really, I think the, by the fact that you had to work in the, um, the, uh, Dry shampoo really helped because it's, you know, you're really getting your roots. And so, yeah, I give this a thumbs, two, two thumbs up. <laughs> and I totally am digging it. So next time, if you guys are at your grocery store and they sell got to be, um, give this a try. I mean, it's worth the money. It's less than 10 bucks. Um, I know a lot of dry shampoos are like the cheapest one or one of the less expensive ones at say like Ulta is like $7.99 and this was even regular price for one bottle of this is at my wall or my particular organs I believe was $5.99 so it's definitely worth it um the Tresemme at Walgreens is $4.99 yes it is more but when you buy it buy one get one free like I did last week it's definitely worth a try I I love how it just it, it really did the fix. And so, yeah. Thanks again for watching. And if you have any questions or concerns about this, um, remember, this is flammable. Do not do it while you're smoking a cigarette, okay? <laughs> Bye, guys. Bye. Mwah.